name is Cecilia Wajiro. I'm the sub-county public health nurse. So this is Beyond Zero campaign, which was started by our first lady. We want zero death during birth. So we have brought this van in Keganjo because we don't have any facility, GOK facility in, the, in Keganjo slum. This van normally rotates in the 12th sub-county for two weeks. So it will be in Dika for two weeks. After Dika, it will go to another sub-county for two weeks. We are three partners in this outreach. We have Kiambu County Government Department of Health, which is housed in the BOD0 track. And they are offering all services. And they are offering for free. We also have Boris Clinic, which is doing uh, RHFP methods. They are also doing cervical cancer screening for free and also treating the positive uh, lesions. Then we also have Tumaini Clinic, which is hosting us in Kiganjo. And they are continuing with their daily activities. Nimeona madaktari wanafundisa watu ku vile wana prevent ugonjwa ya kanza vile tunaweza tumia madawa wanafundisa vile tunaweza tumia madawa sa femiplani people are continuing doing their business some of them are picking kids from school and still they are sparing some time to come to the clinic to get screened to get services, to get drugs, and that is the objective of an outreach. Taking services to the people, or taking services to where people are. We have what we call public-private partnership, and for now we have partnered with PS Kenya, who are supporting us with so many things. Like now they are provided with what we need for cervical cancer screening. Like now the speculum, they are provided with them and also the, the human resource. So through Borders Medical Clinic and through PS Kenya, we are able now to serve the community of Kekajo. Borders is one of the clinic which is under Tunza franchise. When we were recruiting. We realized that Boris, it was a small clinic that was taking care of so many people and it was still working very closely with the government. For instance, during national campaigns such as immunization, they were given a block to take care of that. And one of the criteria for a private clinic to join to the franchise is a clinic that works with the government or a clinic that is certified by the government. We work together. Like uh, doing outreach, we go with them. Sometimes we, we use their clinics in error centers. So we have those private facilities that we use them so that our indicators will go up. Because when we use now our only facility for GAK, we'll not be able to reach all the, the community in Dika sub-county. Every day we see more than 70 to 80 clients in my clinic. And when we have in -leach, we see over 300 or 400. Also we do the in -leach and the outreach. We deal with the family planning, South Africa clinic, screening of cancer, and also we do antenatal clinic and immunization. The reason as to why I'm here at Tumaini Medical is for the cancer screening or the screening of various diseases, HIV status, and uh, all about the family planning. We screened about 217 clients. Out of them, six of them were positive, and to, we have been able to treat all of them, the six of them. So like yesterday, we were able to incite IUCD, about 30 of them, for long-term family planning, that is Jadel and Implanon, 
about 35 of them. We have a good relationship with the PSI Kenya and the Tunza because of helping us, training us how to do the screening and how to treat them and giving us support with the spectrums, rotions. We have managed to train five nurses and one of the nurses is the Tab County Reproductive Health Coordinator or nurse. This is the person, whenever we are going for outreach, we integrate that person in our outreach with the borders. So on behalf of Vika Sub County, we would like to appreciate PS Kenya and we look forward to working with them as we have been doing. Thank you.